So guys, let's understand how you can delete the duplicate rows without using having and group by. Okay. So I have also explained with the row number, but we will uh, see this in next week. Okay. So I have the student database where we have duplicate names. You can see Arav, Arav again and Siya Verma and Siya Verma. Okay. One and two and uh, six and ten. Okay. So we just need to select the row number for deleting these rows. Okay. Or we can directly delete the data as well. So I have mentioned one query here. You can see. So what I'm doing, like I will run this query. Okay. So you can see I can able to find six and ten. Siya Verma and Arav Verma. So what I've did, I've just selected that one table student info and again I've selected this with S1 and S2 and I'm selecting the record where name is same. Okay, you can replace the column name as well which you want. Okay, and then I'm getting the highest all number. Suppose that like there is a Arav Verma and Siya Verma. Okay, so one, so the first one is the original record and the second one is a duplicate record. Okay, so you can easily add, uh, add the condition where row number is greater than S2 table. S2 table all number. Okay, so when you run this query, we can able to uh, check the records. So for deleting that record, you just need to replace, delete and remove the ID and just delete S1 from SP table. So when you hit that query, so you can see updated rows to and deleted S1 from a student table. And when I select the table, so you can see duplicate removes that. So guys, if you have not watched the complete SQL course, link in the description, you can check this.